A pair of astronomers claim they have found ET signals with have exactly the shape of light pulses that could have been produced by alien beings. They made their controversial findings by combing through 2.5 million readings from distant stars. From this, they believe there are 234 cases of alien signals being sent to Earth. Their claims are disputed by many experts in the field, including the Breakthrough Listen project backed by Yuri Milner, Stephen Hawking and Mark Zuckerberg, which is now working to find an alternative explanation. They believe that it is most likely instrument or analysis error. Researchers led by Professor Armando Bohr from Laval University in Quebec studied signals detected by the Sloan Digital Sky Survey, an 8-foot diameter telescope in Sunspot, New Mexico. The idea is if aliens were flashing lasers out into space. Bursts of radiation would be seen in the light coming from their host stars. It is too early to unequivocally attribute these purported signals to the activities of extraterrestrial civilizations. The Breakthrough Listen Science team at the University of California, Berkeley said in a statement, internationally agreed upon protocols for searches for evidence of advanced life beyond Earth require candidates to be confirmed by independent groups using their own telescopes. And for all now natural explanations to be exhausted before invoking extraterrestrial agents as an explanation. But the authors of the study said they ruled out the most obvious alternative explanations. The researchers used a mathematical analysis tool to sift through signals from 2.5 million stars, working out which ones were natural and which looked like they have been generated on purpose. The mathematical tool to detect these bursts is called a Fourier transformation and it is a fast way to uncover the faint and rapid signals. The signals cannot be caused by instrumental or data analysis effects because they are present in only a very small fraction of stars within a narrow spectral range. The researchers wrote in the paper, which has been published on the preprint site RZIF, they ADDDED, because signal-to-noise ratio considerations predict that the signal should mostly be detected in the brightest objects. While this is not the case, we consider several possibilities, such as rotational transitions in molecules skills, rapid pulsations, and signals generated by extraterrestrial intelligence ETI. The researchers claim to have ruled out most of the other options, while concluding the most likely explanation is the signals were generated by aliens. We find that the detected signals have exactly the shape of an ETI signal predicted in the previous publication and are therefore in agreement with this hypothesis, the researchers said. The fact that they are only found in a very small fraction of stars within a narrow spectral range centered near the spectral type of the Sun is also in agreement with the ETI hypothesis. But others are not convinced. They don't consider every natural possibility and jump prematurely to the supernatural, so to speak. Conclusion Peter Plavchin at Missouri State University in Springfield told New Scientist, I think it's way too premature to do that. Andrew Simeon, the director of the SETI Research Center at the University of California, Berkeley, agreed, adding that there is no bolder claim than the discovery of alien life. The SETI community has established a 0 to 10 scale for quantifying detections of life beyond the Earth called the Rio scale. They have rated this discovery a 0 to 1 on this scale, but the project members said they would follow up on the study.